YouTube, Six Two Sixty, and today I have a little problem with my Motorola Q. This is one of the phones I have, and uh, just watch what happens. Here, I'll turn the light on. Nah, it doesn't matter. I turn it on, and get the Ryzen wireless. And watch what happens with it. Sometimes it resets, and then I get the screen, or sometimes I get the first try. Well, that's how I got the first try. It just, a white screen comes out of the nowhere. So, watch this. These are things I haven't tried, so I don't know if they work. I take the battery out, plug it in through USB, with that the battery, let's see what happens. Maybe, can you do it? Well, I plugged it in without the battery through USB. Let's see what happens. Let's see if it even turns on. Alright, it doesn't turn on, I guess, but put the extended battery in. Okay, guys, this is an extended battery. Here we go. See, it's connected through USB now. Battery cover. This time I got the keypad. Hey, it worked that time. Let's see what happens. Windows Mobile. Um, that's my quick video, guys. That's how to fix your Motorola Q and a problem that you can get with your Motorola Q. Thank you. Subscribe.